Agora TV. The world is thinking. Now, I imagine you're saying to yourselves, thank you for the information on magic and horse erections. <laughs> but what about the end of the world that you were talking about earlier? The coming global superpocalypse that I like to call Ragnarok. <laughs> That's what you're saying to yourself right now. <laughs> What, what about that, John? Will I survive Ragnarok? Probably not. <laughs> let's, just, let's just take a little poll here in the audience. And what I'd like you to do, and I want you to really think about this and what's coming, coming along in this world of ours. Uh, how many of you, I'm going to ask you some simple questions. I just want you to raise your hand if the answer is yes. And try answering honestly for once, OK? Uh, how many of you live in a home that is more than 1,000 feet above sea level? Mm -hmm. I have a feeling a lot of you don't even know how many thousands of feet above sea level <laughs> your home is. Alternately, if you don't live on a home that's 1,000 feet above sea level, how many of you uh, have a home that is a houseboat that can float on a giant tsunami of blood? How many of you live in or near the impact zone of the giant meteor that shall bring to this dimension the giant headless buddy of Nug Shohab? <laughs> yeah, unknown, right? You didn't even, if you go, if you go to, your, uh, to the, the county seat and look in the, in the records, they'll tell you if you're in the, in the zone. <laughs> How many of you have a dog? Oh boy. How many of you have received a golden ticket to board one of Oprah Winfrey's space arcs? <laughs> you may, if you have one, don't raise your hand. <laughs> you will be murdered <laughs> for your golden ticket. Only, I gather that only uh, about 30 of them were distributed, all in copies of Eat, Pray, Love. And I think they've all been sold and resold on eBay over and over again at this point. OK, so here's the situation. You are all going to die. <laughs> but here's the good news. You, or many of you, uh, are makers, right? You're not going to die right away because you have skills. You have real skills. You don't just consume. You build things, like cigar box ukuleles. <laughs> and quasi-functional steampunk Iron Man costumes. <laughs> and marshmallow PVC cannons and dreadlocks. These are the things <laughs> that will help you to survive maybe seven weeks longer. <laughs> 